peeps, welcome to another video with moi and Mr. Parliament. What's up? And he's not even matching with your glasses. Huh? Green glitter? Yeah. You could have you could other glasses to match with. Nah, these are matching just fine. You could have matched with your all American glasses. No, I wouldn't. <laughs> Y'all, comment below. <laughs> um, if you're new, <laughs> welcome, welcome. Um, I'm driving and I am in front of me is a final destination thing going on. So if I am rambling this because I'm like, don't fall off vlog. So um, <laughs> what up peeps? It's Saturday. <laughs> it's Saturday. We're on the way to get three of the, are we going to get men No, we're going to get them or not. We are going to get um, at least three of the four grandkids. And um, yeah, we're running late because they like to talk. <laughs> I hate being late, okay? If y'all know me, you know I like to be prompt on time early. But Mr. Parliament over here, he likes to be late, don't you? We ain't running late. No. We're never late. Yes. We're right on time. No. If we don't make it, then we're late. If you're on time, that, that means you're late. I ain't. If you're early, you're on time. I ain't on nobody's schedule. This is Saturday. It's Saturday. We went thrifting. See? I, I've been driving all day today, and we got some good things, some goodies. Got some bangers. And you'll see on our haul video, which we will do today or tomorrow. Yeah, make sure to go to my channel, 392 Blurred Lines, because uh, we got some good stuff coming up, real good stuff coming up. So y'all be sure to check that out. See some videos on there pretending there's good stuff coming. Just know that in two weeks it's gonna be on and popping on, on the 392 Blurred Lines channel. So be sure to check it out. Ooh, what's he got up his sleeve? <laughs> and if you didn't know, he has another <laughs> this week has been so crazy. Okay, he added another what vehicle you say? A vehicle to our little fleet. We're car people, I guess we're car people, you'll say. And um, so, you know, we always have cars, but I've been looking for, and I'll tell you this, I've been looking for like a daily driver so I don't put like as many miles on my SUV going back and forth to work since I work in the same town that I live in. So I was like, I need to have like a car, something I can do like the commute. Why have we looked at, how many cars have we looked at? Three so far. We've looked at three cars and there's a lot of deceitful people out there. You can ask them a question before wasting our time and theirs. You ask them a, a point blank question and they're just like, yeah, yeah. No, everything is, you know, there's no dents, no dings. Everything's great. Lies. Lies. Three, <laughs> three in a row, you guys. Three in, a, look at the final destination. We're getting around final destination. So that was so crazy. I don't even know how they're even, okay, that's a whole nother story. But out of all the three cars, how, what has it been? Well, the first one we looked at was, uh, was that Mercedes? No. Was that Mercedes, what was it? Um, that Sebring. Yeah, I Looked yeah. at a Chrysler Sebring. I took off work early, because sure. I was like, okay, we talked to the person, I think, I told you guys this on the last vlog video. Did all that. What was his name? Ronnie. That was the dude's name. Yeah, so we talked about that. That's right. We went all the way to Hobart. We went to Hobart, Indiana. I forgot about that one. Homie straight up lied on the phone. He lied Sorry. twice. He lied to me and to Dale. And we got there and it was just junk. Ronaldo lied. <laughs> Ronaldo <laughs> and Hobart. Be honest. <laughs> and then, um, so that was one. Now the Mercedes, it wasn't anything to lie. He no, didn't lie. lie. He was he was cool people, but Dale went and saw this Mercedes. Oh my goodness, you guys. This Mercedes was so fresh, so clean, had everything that I wanted, and it was, real nice. it was super classy, but but, but bum, ba, da. it didn't ride like a Mercedes. It didn't sound like a Mercedes. It just it, it had it had some body work done because he hit a deer with it. So that was already three strikes. Three strikes are out. But he was cool people, you yeah, said. he's real cool. He was cool people, he's so he's guy. he's not on the negative list. He's a cool people, he but just, the, it wasn't what I was about to pay for. No, nah, you wouldn't have been. A, she, I, she wouldn't have been 
pleased with it because it when first thing we started up it just sounded like it was kind of loud I'm like man is it supposed to be that loud he said it's been like that since he got it <laughs> and he's had it for seven years and he says it's always sound like that so i didn't like that and then the ride it didn't ride as smooth as it should have rode the shifting it didn't shift as fast as it should have been shifting it's kind of lazy on the shift so that let me know the tranny probably is on his way out and plus at the end of the day found out he hit a deer with it <laughs> you got one side the lights is real bright the headlight and the other side is all dingy and 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 uh got the oxidation on it so it would have needed a new headlight on the passenger side along with a park light but it was fresh Strikes. on the outside like it looked so cute it had a leather interior and all the like it had all the bells and whistles but just it was a negative negative my money comes hard but i'm not about to just waste it on junk and then somebody say and then and then, and then. one more time and I don't even know why, because I, at this point, I was just, like, kind of annoyed by softness. I don't even know why, you guys. But it had leather, and it was, it was, looked all right on the outside. What was it? It was at Ford Focus. Ford Focus. She and I don't even know why. Say this a Ford Focus. I don't Look even out. know why, you guys. Like, <laughs> she, it just looked like it, it would have been cute. Let right? me tell you why. Because that money burner pocket i was like and i need to just want to get some it was it had leather interior it had a moon <laughs> roof it, had, it looked good in the picture see don't pictures can be very deceiving jump why we get over there okay number one we pull up to the address he gave us it was a gas station right there okay flag. it was a red flag i was like oh man and then i called and it went to voicemail. So I was like, well, you know what? This ain't a waste of trip because it was in Mishawaka and I could get my car washed. So I was not even mad because that's like the best car wash. So I was like, man, then called back and then he was like, I'll be there in 10, 15 minutes. Not I told the dude we're turning on Grape Road or whatever. And he's like, okay. And then when he said that, I kind of got loud on the phone, didn't I? I was like, 10 minutes? Because like I was already, yeah, I was already irritated like when you when you're trying to sell some them somebody tell them you're on your way you'll be there in a second you give us a gas station i don't know it was already strikes like dead serious at that point i was about to just drive off right i was like you know what this is this is already a sign so <laughs> what you tell them the rest deal yeah brother pulled up i'm just straight from zimbabwe oh my gosh <laughs> you went there i wasn't gonna go there my brother pulled up man he, he already talking crazy pulled up and um, I, it's already about dark. I mean, it's about dark. So now I gotta, I gotta really check this thing out in the dark. So first thing I did, I walked around looking at it. His seat all sitting all the way back in the back seat. <laughs> so here we go. Oh, it's a hood. I'm, sm I'm smelling all the cologne coming up out of the car. I'm like, oh, man. Yeah, I, I walk know. around, walk around the passenger side. What catches my eye was the bottom just didn't look right down by the kicker panel. So I went down there and I tapped it with that knuckle. You know, anybody know anything about body work, you know a dead sound. You know, you know metal and you know bondo. Man, both them core, them rockers, both of them solid as rocks. They must have been full of bondo. So I asked him, I said, let me ask you something. No, I told him I ain't asking nothing. I said, this thing had body work done down there, them rockers didn't. He said, oh, I ain't gonna lie to you. It had some body work. I said, I know it did. I said, well, from right there, let me know. I don't want it. I'm not putting her in anything. It has body work done. I said, I don't have a problem spending money. We just test drove a Mercedes. I don't have a problem spending money. But I'm not buying nothing that's had a bunch of body work done. I said, so I'm not going to waste your time. And I might as well not waste no more of my time. But I thank you for, for coming down here and letting us check it out. It was like a two-minute transaction. And then, okay, about lying. On the thing I said, it has there been any dense right? No, perfect condition. That's what I'm saying. I'm like, Oh my goodness, what is up? What is up? It's like there's a whole bunch of duds. <laughs> like <laughs> in this car dealer lot, there was like there was this Dodge Charger. No, okay. That <laughs> I forgot about this one. So there was this Dodge Dart. Okay, the year the year was good. I forgot about that one. Okay, next was this Dodge Dart. 
it was cute i was like okay this looks like you know it might be good had decent miles on it and it's a dodge you know mopar i'm like dang. i was like well let, let's check it out i sent the pictures of dale and what'd you say nothing but a big dent dents all over <laughs> rust didn't want it junk and junk. wasn't there like formula or something like that you said that, it might have oh that one with the back yeah. What are you talking about? Cars we done looked at. You sent me something. No, many that was pictures. the charger. The Chrysler had a big dent in the door. What Chrysler? That, that was a charger, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah, that was a that charger. That was a charger. See, there was a dart. <laughs> I don't know. Like everything <laughs> I'm telling mouth. you, everything has been like negative. Dart. Yeah, but that uh that dart, man, it had it had looked like I saw the stains on the seat. No. And we're particular, them, them, like we're super. Bed sheet stains. <laughs> <laughs> what? The mattress stains. It was, mattress stains on the in like the car. milk. Like if a kid spilled milk or something like that. It, it was. In I could tell seats. it was a kid that had the stains on it because when you looked in the picture in that back window, it had one of those shades that sticks to the window. So I know that they had a child in the back, and that's what all them stains was. Probably milk formula and so that's what all them stains was on them seats yeah but it so, wasn't just in the back it was it was on the front seat it too. was i don't know stains all over didn't the see that like he blew the pictures up see, i, I like didn't see that in. i was like but i'm sorry we're not even gonna come not see when it come too hard to be spending on i junk. said yeah we're not even gonna come see that and then there was a dodge charger oh, okay. that that was in a car lot and um they had that inside the building they had it inside the building and it had a dent on it yeah and then there's this uh maxima and maxima was junk and then how much did he wanted so much money for this he was asking 55 for it he said he would have it priced more but it had a rebuild title it's been right what in the world now he's trying to get some money from a rebuild title piece of junk junk okay I don't want that either. So, so I we still looking. Yeah, I told myself like there's okay. I told myself my number one car that I want is an Audi because it's all wheel drive and we test drove an Audi before and I liked it. So that's why I'm just oh not gonna gosh. settle. I'm not gonna settle for any other junk. I think I'm just gonna just do something nice, keep on saving up my pennies, and I'm gonna get an Audi for a daily driver. I heard that because all this stuff out here is just garbage. And I can't believe how people are lying. That's what gets, like, be upfront, be honest. Don't waste my time. They just want to make a quick dollar and think they got to up because I'm a woman. But, but that brother, he did say, well, to be honest, it had body. Well, you ain't got to tell me. I already know. You dealing with somebody who know cars. I know cars. I know if they got body work. Tap on them. Then you hit a dead spot. <laughs> oh, that's Bondo. Oh, no. You got the wrong <laughs> one. I don't we're want to do with this. We're car people. We we know what stuff is supposed to be. So, oh, stay tuned. One day I'll find a, a nice Audi. Yeah, but I did find it. I I did post a video. Let me check out three nine two blurred lines. I did post a video a, a video of of the new addition to the Mopar gang. What did he get? Check it out, y'all. Find is out. it a Mopar? Do, do, do. Hmm. But know. the Audi is not going to be a Mopar, but. I, I told myself, like, my top two cars I wanted was an Audi or a Mustang. So, I think I'm just going to do my top three cars and not settle for anything else. What do you think? I think so. I, I think, think so, too. For it. Man, I like that. Live right your life. Man, that thing is clean. Live your best life, honey. The right wheel on it. It'd be sweet. That's not my style. That's my style. Because I want, or a Lincoln. Because I had a Lincoln. I had, oh, how many Lincolns did I have? Two. Oh, that Porsche's cute. That Porsche's sweet. I've had two Lincolns, so I like a car, a comfortable car, or a 300. That's what my three. So I'll have, okay, I'll do an Audi, and we test drove a Mustang. I'll only get a Mustang if it's a stick shift. And, okay, an Audi, a stiff shift, a stiff, a shift, <laughs> a stick shift on a Mustang. I don't even know. No, there's too many S's, like. Careful. But not nothing bad was gonna come out. But I was like, <laughs> just trying to get a tutor who tutored a flute. <laughs> trying to tutor to tutor to toot. So the toot, so the tutor. Is it harder to toot or to tutor to tutor to toot a flute? Yeah. Mr. Schultz will tell me that way. <laughs> Boom. Okay. So Audi, Mustang, stick shift, Chrysler 300, not a 200 because I test drove a 200 and it's not because I had a Chrysler 300 
I traded in for my Lincoln. And that Porsche is sweet. So I've had Lincolns. So it'll have to be a Audi, a Lincoln, stick shift Mustang, or Chrysler 300. So those are what I want. So I'm gonna have to save up my pennies and do that. I have a, a nice little chunk saved up and I'm just gonna have to save up more to get something right because these ones that are, that people are asking for, I don't know. If you save up enough, you know, go to the car lot and just buy one at a car lot and then your payment is gonna be real cheap because you're gonna have a real nice down payment. That's true. I didn't so think about that. Car lot. Well, Gary, we might have to be seeing you. Look out, Gary. Here we come again. You, you know what I want. You already know my style. <laughs> know that Lincoln. Real nice. Where? Just went by. Like, oh, yeah. Mm. Say like Lincoln's. Lincoln's. But, like, I had the MKX. Was it MKX? MKX. But, like, the transmission or something like that was about to go out. So, I don't want to get stuck with that no more. Dirty Denali. Dirty Denali. See, we like cars. I don't know. For some reason. Yeah, I'm no respect of car. I, I drive anything. But I do like Maximus yeah, too, though. Sweet. Those like are that. like a new one. That's real nice. I don't know. Just so many cars <sighs> in the world. So many options. We just want something that's reliable, something that's dependable, something gonna go from A to B, and not have any problems getting there. I really don't want a car, no. I already have a car, no. Oh my goodness, Walmart. Packed. Oh my gosh, it's like at least how many they thousand? Ready for the shutdown. Oh my gosh. We got 51 pounds of items at the bins today. 51. It felt like more than that, didn't it? It was 52. It seemed like we got so much stuff. Like, I thought it was more pounds than that. But I really did. I was like, this is about to be like 80 pounds of stuff. When she said 52, I was like, hey, I'll take that. We got some good. Oh, look at that Challenger. Oh, look at that Challenger. That nasty Challengers one. are cute. RT but like they're more sporty. I'm not a sporty car person. Only the Mustang. I think that's like the only sporty car that I would drive. Now you drove the scat pack, so quit playing. But I mean, quit playing. But do I want it for Stop myself? Stop playing with me. Do I, do I want it for myself? <laughs> that's the question. No. Woo, that's too yeah. much money. Yeah, I know too... about that scat pack. Oh yeah, I gotta go to. Oh, Y'all don't know about the scat pack. Go three nine two blurred lines. Check it out. Are you gonna move playing. over, person? We up in Indiana where they driving yeah, crazy, y'all. Us Michigan drivers, we drive very conservative. Um, Ooh, look at Chick Fil A. <laughs> look at Chick Fil A. Oh that my chicken goodness! Ain't that good. That chicken is pretty good, <laughs> but we know what place is better: Popeyes. What? The Popeyes okay, chicken on. sandwich. I can't be looking. I'm about to ruin oh, this economics. Right out there. That's what they got going on. I can't mess with Dale. He about to. Hey, you see how they doing that? I'm not looking, Dale. They sit your foot out on the desk, and you gotta go out there and pick it up. Those are probably the they grub paranoid. Hub. Probably the grub hub stuff. That I bet that's what that is. That's what it is. That's what that is. But we are almost to the destination for Brianna to get these little babies. Oh, it's gonna be a long night. The babies. <laughs> <laughs> that's why I talked to them. I'm gonna get suck up babies. this chance. I'm suck up these opportunities while I can. Because one day they're going to get older and they're going to get bigger and they ain't going to want nothing to do with grandparents. We had Minnow last night and it was so sweet. It just touched my heart. He came to the garage. Dale was in the garage. He ran up to Dale because Dale didn't know I was going to get him. I didn't know I was going to get him either. But um, he ran up to Dale. What did he say, Dale? I missed you. He gave him a hug. He was like, I missed you. It was so sweet. It was so sweet. There she is out there. So, all right, we are at the location. Looks like Sophie's trying to. Oh, see. <laughs> ain't no need we ain't going to go there. <laughs> but, um... <laughs> but, all right, we're at the location. We will talk with you guys later. Stay tuned for our haul video. And thanks for watching. Peace. All right, bye.